Hello class 12, we have this short video on energy, mass and momentum of a photon. So you might be asked to derive the expressions for, you know, different expressions for the mass of a photon or for the momentum of a photon also. Okay, or you might get numericals also, simple numericals also based on these equations. Alright, now for a photon, remember a photon is never at rest. A photon is always mobile. So therefore, the rest mass of a photon is zero. But since it is always mobile, so therefore it has some kinetic energy or, or rather its kinetic mass. So therefore the kinetic mass of a photon is not zero. All right. Now from Einstein's energy mass relation. Now what is energy mass relation that of Einstein? I forgot to write over here. It is E is M C squared. So this is called Einstein's energy mass relation. So and from Einstein's energy mass relation, M is the kinetic mass of photon. C is the speed of light or so to say C is the speed of photon. So therefore the energy of a photon is mc squared. But from Planck's quantum theory, we also know that the energy of a photon is h into nu. So E is h nu which is mc squared. So from here, the mass of the photon is h nu by c squared. Now from the famous relation between velocity, frequency and lambda. Okay, V is n lambda also. Many a times we see this written. So from here, the frequency, where n is frequency, mind you, lambda is wavelength. Instead of n, we have nu written over here. So nu is c by lambda for a photon. So substituting this value of nu in here, you get to see is m is h by c squared into the value of nu, c by lambda. So m is h by c lambda, okay? after multiplying so m is h by c lambda and m is also h nu by c squared we have two expressions for mass of a photon and this is kinetic mass of a photon remember this is not the rest mass of a photon kinetic mass okay <clears throat> another thing now momentum of a photon momentum we know basically is mass into velocity but here we need to talk about kinetic mass of photon and its speed so photon its mass is h nu by c squared, h nu by c squared. So h nu by c squared mass into speed of photon is c, we get h nu by c. So this is one expression for momentum of a photon. Another expression for mass was h by c lambda. So using that expression for mass into velocity is h by lambda. So momentum is h by lambda. Do pay attention to this because we will need this. Momentum is h by lambda. So there are different expressions for momentum also. So momentum is h nu by c from here, which h by lambda from here also, since h nu is energy of photon, E, so this is also E by c. So this is the expression for different expressions for momentum of a photon and mass of a photon. The reason I say pay attention to this, that is, Momentum is h by lambda because we are going to do something called de Broglie hypothesis where we will need this. P is h by lambda. So you might get simple numericals based on these equations also. So thank you all so much.